This is the Texas Weekly Newsreel, and as we approach the holiday break, as we seem to do every two years, we have something like a race for speaker. Uh, David Simpson from Longview says he is praying over whether he should run for speaker or not. Brian Hughes from Mineola says he is staying in the race in spite of a rumor that he might get out. And Joe Strauss says he's got the votes. He won't show us what they are, but his faction says that he has over 100 members who've said that they'll support him for another term as speaker. The three things that have imperiled the last three speakers or the last several speakers, scandal, a party change, or a bill of particulars about the way that they're running the House don't seem to exist here. Even if they did, Strauss's opponents would have to figure out a candidate that they could support with the coalition they've got, which appears at this moment to be consisting of liberal Democrats and very conservative Republicans who usually don't agree on anything else. So we'll see how that develops, but right now it looks like Strauss is probably okay. The campaign finance deadline lands this week. This is the blackout that marks the beginning of a legislative session, runs through the session until Father's Day. It starts a month before the legislature actually convenes, so Saturday is the last day they can collect checks, and it runs through the end of the session and through the 20-day period after the session during which the governor vetoes bills. And so there's a line of people outside the Austin Club in Austin giving checks to candidates just for this last week. That's the newsreel.